This morning on Today Food, we are tackling dinner and dessert and drinks, too. And we're keeping it all vegetarian. Here to help is Mary McCartney. Hello. She's a cookbook author and host of the Emmy-nominated cooking show. Mary McCartney serves it up on Discovery Plus, where she cooks with some of her famous friends. Oh, and she happens to be the daughter of someone else we all know, Sir Paul McCartney. So good morning, Mary. It's so nice to have you here. Thank you for having me. So you are cooking vegetarian for us, but we don't need to, you know, be scared of that. It's fast, <laughs> easy, and you're going to be, I think you're going to be impressed. Already. Well, so they're already first, eating, and they have good. been eating for the last two minutes, so. So this is a caponata skillet pizza, um, and I'm starting off, it's like an Italian sort of inspired topping, mm -hmm. which is one eggplant, some red onion, which adds some color. So you don't color. peel the eggplant. You just, just chop it up into little bite-sized okay. pieces. Fry it off, uh, saute it in a little bit of olive oil or vegetable oil. Then I'm going to add a little bit of chopped uh, canned tomatoes. Okay. Oh. Tomato, it's just nice and juicy, too. and this topping is like a real meal. It makes it very substantial. So this will be the sauce and the topping all mixed in the one. It's wine. so quick, and okay. you, you, you want that nice little sizzle and bubble mm -hmm. that we're getting. Oh, that smells really delicious. Then I've got three cloves of garlic, mm. and yeah. it's adding flavor. Uh, and I love the olives. Olive olives chopped mm -hmm. in half. Nice you can saltiness. use any kind of olives, though, really, okay. as long as do not leave the pips in. <laughs> <laughs> you Don't, bite into that, it just doesn't have the same. You do not want any broken teeth. Yes. And uh, I like a little bit of chili heat. Mm -hmm. So I'm perfect. going to really add good. chili flakes, everything, you know, what you would have in Whatever. your store cupboard. Okay. And depending how spicy you want it, you can add or take away. Okay, so that's and our topping. That's literally it. And are you making the dough also? Yes. Oh. Okay. So that just cooks off for a few minutes. Mm -hmm. You could even put it on like that. Now, the dough is a flatbread, which has uh, all-purpose flour, mm -hmm. a little bit of baking powder, just so it kind of puffs up and has a little lift when it okay. cooks. What else are you adding now to I'm it? Now I'm going to stir in a quarter of a cup of unsweetened plant-based milk. As Whatever long as it's like. unsweetened, okay. you can use oat, cashew, almond. <laughs> and I'm adding enough, like a quarter of a cup. Okay. I want to make sure we enough. have time for dessert. So oh, once that's all that mixed in. together, this olive oil. And some olive oil so it's nice and glossy. Mm. Then that will come together into a nice into dough. Mm -hmm. Literally, you don't need to leave it. It's, it's ready really to go. Good. I would want this on so many other things, too. Roll it out. Where are you going to cook that? In this in pan? In the skillet. Oh, yeah. Oh so literally... If you don't have a rolling pin, you can use a wine bottle or <laughs> oh, which any is always bottle nice. that you have. Then, then this you would go, right you roll there. it to the side of the skillet and then cook it on a nice hot skillet for three so minutes good. each side. And then you throw the topping Chop on. The topping You've got on. to Dylan, try this. Yes. And then try the dessert. Because and I like yeah. to just put mm. all the topping in the middle like oh, this. Wow. Just shove it on. And then push it out to the side, so it's got nice height. That is so you know what? And a handle. Yeah, like even if you're not a vegetarian, this is something for yeah. everyone. Mm -hmm. All I of was... my cooking is more aimed towards non-vegetarians. Okay. I was skeptical about this dessert because of oh, the secret ingredient. Let me show you. Yes. Let me show you. I, I am a no believer. Baked dessert, so we should be no able to bake chocolate this tart. Up the mm. thing that there's no whipping of cream, no like egg whites. It's um, it's silken tofu. What? Silken tofu. A it's bar tofu. of chocolate. Melted. Melted. Okay. That's just tofu in A it? little bit of vanilla. No, I'm curious. And uh, hot chocolate powder. Oh, really? Hot chocolate powder. So then you don't need to add any other sugar so or anything. Whip, whip it together. Wow. And it goes really loosey. Wow. And the thing with the... That's literally it. The thing wow. with the tofu is know, right? it's a flavor carrier and what it's kind a texture. Of tofu? It's silken it's tofu, silk. like they use okay. a lot of Japanese cooking. Oh my god! Yeah. So you don't, right it doesn't in. taste like tofu. Yeah. Right, this is delicious. And then you, you don't even have to Shove bake it. Shove it in here, and literally you can decorate it and eat it. But right. I would probably put it in the fridge for 15 mm -hmm. minutes to set. Wow! Just, All right, thank you so you much. The new season so of good. Mary McCartney serves it up. It's streaming now on Discovery Plus, and of course. Get these recipes. Just go to today.com slash food. We'll have to put the drink recipe on the website. Thank you so much. Oh, yeah. I'm going to try the cocktail. This is Cheers. This is for you. Cheers. Thank you for having me. Thank you. Thank you.